This is a two week immersive and visual form. So you'll be spending um, two classes. This week's project and next week's project will continue with visual form. Wonder, which of these letters in the word form looks like they're floating? Which one looks like it's sitting directly on the page? What visual clues tell you that? Creating form is challenging and super fun. There are two types of form you learn about in art, visual form and actual form. You will learn about visual form today, where an object is created on a flat surface in a way to make it look three-dimensional. Different values of light and dark can make a rectangle, which is a shape, into a form, a cylinder, or a circle, a shape, into a sphere, which is a form. Learning the skills of creating visual form will help you to draw more realistically. Visual form is very important in animation, design, game design, pre-production images for movies, drawings of architecture, sneaker design, fashion, and more. Creating visual form, noticing light, shadows, and value. These three are images from a Pixar in a Box exercise called Lighting an Orange. They all began with an orange in the same space. How are they the same and how are they different? Where's the light coming from? Does the light bounce off of a place? You will explore light, then work with value to help create form. In a moment, when I say pause, you're going to navigate to exercise three online of Pixar in a box, lighting a virtual orange. You're going to scroll down to here, change the, and down here, it's, you'll get to toggle these back and forth, slide them back and forth, and change the light. Can you change the shadow? Can you change the mood or the feeling to be happy or sad based on the color of the light? How does changing the light change the form? So pause here, play around with light on that virtual orange, and then come back to this video. Part two.